Well, we first told you in November about the SS John W. Brown. The World War II era ship docked in Canton was in search of a new home. Tonight, we have good news because it appears they have found one, and it's right here in Baltimore. Sean Stryker joins us from the ship. Sean, it made sense, and we're all happy to see it stay in this city. Yeah, Denise, it made perfect sense. This piece of American history was built here in Baltimore in 1942. It was used in World War II before returning back to the city in 88, and now it looks like it will remain here for years to come. The SS John W. Brown is 440 feet long, 59 feet wide. Built in Baltimore in 1942, it was used by the U.S. Merchant Marine to transport troops and cargo during World War II. If you ever want to see a piece of history, come on down. Today, its mission is slightly different. Serve as a training tool for local law enforcement and maritime academies and operate as a floating museum. It's a versatile piece of equipment. Now, for the past three and a half years, the SS John W. Brown was in search of a new home. They finally found one, and it's right here in Baltimore. Lease is up, time for us to move. And when they couldn't find a place to move to, they decided to build one, or at least rebuild one, at the former Bethlehem Steel Fairfield Shipyard, the same shipyard that built the SS John W. Brown some 78 years ago. Fairfield actually built the most Liberty ships of any one, one yard. The rebuild, which is being done in partnership with the Maritime Applied Physics Corporation, will allow the ship to operate more freely. But more importantly, it keeps a piece of American history right where it belongs. It was built here, sailed from here, and now it's back here at 70 years old. And we hope to keep it another 70. Now this whole project is expected to cost $18 million and they plan on using a combination of federal and state funding as well as different donations. It's expected to take two years and in the meantime it's going to be moving to a temporary location which is also here in Baltimore. Reporting in Canton, I'm Sean Stryker for WJZ.